Happy Boy was not quite happy at all after the results of the Groovy semifinals was announced last Thursday night. The artist made it to the semifinals of both the Groovy and Soca competitions. Clevon took to social media the next morning to express his disappointment with not making the final list. Speaking to the media following his performance in the Soca semifinals Friday night, he revealed that his fans are the only reason he participated. First off, I didn't come here for the competition, you know, because we all know how this competition is set up and how they set up their things. We all know they have their favorites and who they want to put in. And after last night, after last night, it kind of broke my meds and broke my spirit. I've been trying here for years and every year is the same thing. Always getting left here in Progress Park. So I wasn't going to come here tonight, but after seeing the messages from the fans and the calls from the fans and they say, yo, come and perform for your fans. Come and show up and do your thing. Don't let that break you. I decided to come here and I didn't come here for the competition. My goal was to come and please my fans. And I think I did just that. And as long as they are pleased and happy, then I'm pleased and happy. They could, they could do what they want with their competition here. This is my, I'm being blatantly honest. This is my last year in competition. I give up. He said, however, he will continue to create music in a different arena. Speaking to other artists such as Boise, who appears to be one of the bigger contenders in the race, he said he's not moved by the criticisms. When somebody sees you as a threat, you understand? As they say, children don't pelt stone, be an empty mango tree. So I guess they see me as a threat. So I mean, it's a good vibe. It's a good thing. And when, once I reach in the finals, then the ball game change. You understand? So until then, the judge's decision is always final. So waiting on the results first. Friday night's Soka semi-final saw a tie for the 11th position, resulting in 12 artists entering the finals, looking to snatch the title from Shem Bernard, Terra the Governor. With $100,000 in cash and kind up for grabs, Soka artists are banking on delivering their A-game come back on Friday, August 9th at the Kirani James Athletic Stadium. The Dr. Trevor Friday Power Soka semifinals held at Progress back last Friday was a showcase of raw talent and infectious energy. Each contestant had seven minutes to captivate the judges' attention and thousands of enthusiastic fans in the crowd. The artists did not disappoint and the supportive fans for their money's worth. Christina John, GBN News.